We are at Woodlawn Cemetery in Nashville, Tennessee, where we have come to pay our respects to one of the legendary greatest of all time country music stars, none other than George the Possum Jones. George Glenn Jones was born September the 12th, 1931. He was an American musician, singer, and songwriter. He achieved international fame for his long list of hit records, including his best known song, He Stopped Loving Her Today, as well as his distinctive voice and phrasing. For the last two decades of his life, Jones was frequently referred to as the greatest living country singer. Country music scholar Bill Malone writes, for the two or three minutes consumed by a song, Jones immerses himself so completely in its lyrics and in the mood of it conveys that the listener can scarcely avoid becoming similarly involved. Waylon Jennings expressed a similar opinion in his song, It's All Right. If we could all sound like we wanted to, we'd all sound like George Jones. The shape of his nose and facial features earned Jones the nickname, The Possum. George Jones has been called the Rolls Royce of country music and had more than 160 chart singles to his name from 1955 until his death in 2013. Born in Texas, Jones first heard country music when he was seven and he was given a guitar at the age of nine. He married his first wife, Dorothy Bonvillain, in 1950 and was divorced in 1951. He served in the United States Marine Corps and was discharged in 1953. He married Shirley Ann Corley in 1954. In 1959, Jones recorded White Lightning, written by J.P. Richardson, which launched his career as a singer. His second marriage ended in divorce in 1968. He married fellow country music singer Tammy Wynette a year later. Years of alcoholism compromised his health and led to his missing many performances, earning him the nickname No Show Jones. After his divorce from Wynette in 1975, Jones married his fourth wife, Nancy Sebvaldo in 1983 and became sober for good in 1999. Jones died in 2013 at the age of 81 from hypoxic respiratory failure. During his career, Jones had more than 150 hits, both as a solo artist and duets with other artists. Robert Cristago has called him Honky Tonk's greatest honky. George Jones will live on in our hearts forever.